Um, and in this section, I, I want to talk about um, some of the, the uh, aspects of this matrix, this mind prison that we actually live in and how we create it um, and uh, how it's manipulated so that our reality becomes the reality the manipulators want us to have because it suits their agenda. And part of that is realizing that we are not physical bodies, whether they're black, white, or sky blue, pink. That's not what we are. That's a vehicle to experience this reality. We are consciousness, infinite consciousness, that never dies. The word does not exist in consciousness. And uh, therefore, if we consider ourselves to be uh, physical people, there is no David I. David Icke is just the name for an experience infinite consciousness is having in this reality. That's all it is. It's just an experience. And if we start identifying with David Icke and Joe Bloggs, we get pulled into seeing ourselves as little insignificant people. Oh, I'm just, I'm just Joe Public, I am, what can I do? And that's why we're constantly pushed into those, that disconnected state where we identify who we are with what we're doing. People, it's kind of funny, isn't it? Where um, people identify who they are with, 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 with their job. They say like, what are you? Oh, I'm a coal miner. I sweep the streets. I'm an airline pilot. I actually am in the city of London. And then we kind of judge who they are. And they judge who they are by what they're doing. It's just an experience. That's all it is. I mean, how many people go up to someone and they say, hey, hello, hello nice to meet you. Who are you? And you say, I'm everything that exists. Nice to meet you. We don't do that. I mean, in, in, in a sane and enlightened world, the other guy would say, hey, yes, yeah, so am I. I thought I recognized you. <laughs> the divisions are there to divide us. So I want to go into all that and many other things.